All right, now you are going to go crazy looking at this feature. You see, we have got this camera notch right here. I will just tap on this. The flashlight turns on. I'll tap on that again. The light turns off. Now look at this. I will tap on this again. I can take a screenshot. I can also assign this tab to open a particular application. For example, let me just tap on this. You see the camera application is open and likewise, I can set it to open any other third party application. This is just crazy, isn't it? I'm sure you're wondering how is this even possible? This is a feature which is not available by default on the phone. You need a third party application called Touch the Notch. I left a link in the description for you to download it. You'll find it on the Play Store. Just download the application, open it and give some permissions and you're good to go. On the free version, only single touch feature would work. And for long touch, double click, swipe right to left, swipe left to right options are available on the premium version. And the premium version is not that expensive. If you're interested, you can go ahead and upgrade it to premium as well. Now you see under single touch, I've got various options to select. By default, nothing is selected. You can select some actions like toggle camera flashlight, take a screenshot, open the power button, long press menu. Then we have access options, minimized applications drawer, open camera, open recent applications menu, open selected application by tapping on which you can select any application that you have on your phone. Then we have modes, tools, communication, media, system. There are so many options to select. And after you select it, just tap on the notch. The application will execute that action for you. This works something like the one hand operation plus application we have on Samsung Galaxy phones. With one hand operation plus application, we have got different swipes in different directions to execute actions. And here we have got touch and swipe action on the notch to execute a particular action. Of course, we do have double click option as well. You can select a function for double click or double tap on the camera notch. You can also get haptic feedback when you touch on the notch. The phone will vibrate on the touch, letting you know that the function has been executed. And on the landscape mode, if you do not want to activate this, you can disable it by selecting this option here. A brilliant application you must download and check out. Do let me know what do you think about it in the comment section. Kudos to the developer of this app. They've done a great job and it's a thoughtfully done application which you must download and check out. That's about it. I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead, hit the subscribe button and become a part of Apex community. We are inching closer to 100k subscribers. Do support us and subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find it useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye. I don't know what I'm doing, what I'm doing, what I'm doing.